I'm Lori Kessler, <laughs> freshman girls basketball coach, and these are the freshmen. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Thank you for coming out tonight, even though I'm pretty little liar's son, and if you can be already, please don't tell me. Okay. How many of your parents are going to be already for you? Raise your hand. I have not taught them anything. Anyway, uh, a lot has happened to us this season. There was an ACL tear, not unlike what happened to the University. There was major ankle sprain, there was a shoulder issue, knee pains, general illnesses. Uh, but the kicker, and now the new record, would be the five separate concussions that we had. Once that occurred while slamming into each other in a game. So I'm not sure if that even helped. Not quite sure. But all this either proves that it's an awfully long season, or these girls gave it their all every second that they were out on that court. They both were giving it their all, because they sure did. They played hard and they never gave up, and they always played with Christian attitude. And for that, I am most proud of these girls. Putting Christ first and letting your light shine is extremely difficult. When the game gets heated, or the call is obviously the fun. <laughs> like Neil's game. Anyway, um, <laughs> I've let it go, though. Or, or even when your coach is yelling, but never me, of course, because I'm, you know, cool as a cucumber, right? They can barely hear me. Um, and this was a team through and through and for the first time in my coaching career, and I know I only look 21, but it's been a long time, <laughs> that I'm going to tell players to actually be selfish. <laughs> that was rare, but a really cool problem to have. Of course, when you drive in a lane and then you want to dish off and you're right there and you're yelling, be selfish, you know, and the other coach looks like you're an idiot. But, um, but I was proud of these girls. Uh, this is a great group. And a lot of credit goes to you guys as parents. Absolutely. Thank you for getting them here. I know it's a long haul. Uh, thank you for making sure that we were always fed immaculate. I mean, you know, my son would come because he would help out once in a while, so he'd usually eat with us, and he, a couple times, made the comment, why can't you cook like that? <laughs> so, uh, I locked him in the closet, and <laughs> I threw the thrillers at him, so that's what he did. And thank you always for supporting him. Absolutely, every game. A shining example of who you are, of who they are, starts with you. And you're doing a wonderful job. These are great young women. Thank you to Bill Hirschville. I know he's here. He said he was going to listen to me. He made me very nervous. And all the parent volunteers who are doing the scorebook and the clock for every home game. And thank you, athletes, for a fantastic season. I'm going to introduce these girls. We're going to step out to this little guy. Stay there. Okay? Anyway, blow your parents to death. That would be okay. All right. Are we ready? Michelle Drager, Emily Perch, Cindy Grohmeyer, Samantha Eaton, Megan Wall, Anna Day, 